Good morning, everyone. 各位来宾，早上好。With the ceremony beginning shortly,、uh, we would like to invite all guests to take a seat. Kindly give us your attention as we make a few important announcements. 婚礼即将开始，请大家尽快就座。我们这里有几项重要的报告。Firstly, please ensure that your mobile phones and all other electronic devices are switched to silent mode. 请大家将你们的电子设备转为静音模式，好让今天的典礼不受干扰。Secondly, the toilets and cry room is、uh, situated actually outside on the right,、uh, outside this sanctuary. 洗手间和婴儿室在正门出去的右手边。Also, we have a photographer taking photos today,、uh, but feel free to take as many photos and videos、uh, for of the ceremony as well, and do tag the couple on your social,、uh, social media pages. Uh, for family and friends who are tuning in online,、um, do take as many screenshots as you would like. 此外，在这喜乐的日子，我们邀请在场或在线上的亲戚朋友尽情的拍照留念，然后把照片上载到社交媒体上，让我们的新人能够稍后观赏。Do also scan the QR code、um, on the screen. Wait up!、Uh, wait for the screen to come up first. <laughs> So basically, yeah, scan the QR code on the screen to leave your words of blessings for the couple. 请大家用电话扫屏幕上的 QR 码，把你们的祝福写在啊、uh, Pat 乐网址上。We'll begin shortly, and we'll come back when the ceremony is just about to begin.
just about to begin, but before that, the couple has actually prepared a photo montage. It's a, a very cute one, right? <laughs> so just please enjoy. How deep, how deep the Father's love for us. How vast beyond all measure that He should give His only Son to make a wretch His treasure. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the couple and their family members, we warmly welcome and thank you for being here to witness the holy matrimony between Vernon and Grace. 在此我请代表新人和新人的家属感谢大家出席与见证郑杰宏和阮瑞诗的结婚胜利 We will also like to welcome family and friends who are joining us online on this beautiful occasion. My name is Ihan, and beside me is my wife, Tingying. And we'll be your MCs this morning. We'll now like to invite uh, the couple's mothers on stage to light the candles. These candles symbolizes the life that has been given to both Vernon and Grace by God through their mothers. Thank you, mothers. All right. The moment that we have all been waiting for. Are you all ready? Okay, so we're going to start with the 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, let us begin the wedding procession. Please rise. 各位来宾，请大家站立。盛礼即将开始。Let us give a round of applause to welcome the bride. 让我们以热烈的掌声欢迎新娘入场。感恩喜乐的心积极在上帝的面前要见证祝福正结红和伟斯来进行这个基督的婚姻来结为夫妇婚姻的约是上帝所设立的他为难造你也为你造难在他亲临的能力中耶稣施你加利利的迦南宴席
never ceases. His mercies never come to an end. They are new every morning, new every morning. Great is thy faithfulness, O Lord. Great is thy faithfulness. They are new every morning, new every morning. Great is thy faithfulness, O Lord. Great is thy faithfulness. To I your
生爱你，一生敬拜你，一生爱你，一生荣耀你，一生奉献，一生不回头，一生爱你，跟随你，一生爱你。一生爱你，跟随你。是的，感谢主你的爱。阿门。Now let us invite Reverend Timothy Ang to open us in prayer. 我们有请洪培正牧师为我们做开始祷告。Let us pray. Our dearest Heavenly Father, as we come before you on this joyous occasion to celebrate the holy matrimony of Vernon and Grace, Lord, we we give you thanks for your faithfulness and your steadfast love towards them, guiding them through their relationship journey thus far. We thank you that your grace. Has sustained them through the seasons, and we ask that the same grace may be poured out upon them and their relationship in the journey ahead. That the vows that they undertake today, they may live out for a lifetime. Lord, I pray that your covenant love may keep them through the ups and downs, for better, for worse, because their love is based upon. This unconditional and boundless love of Christ, that is to be at the center and the foundation of their marriage. So, Lord, may you bless them in every way in the journey ahead, and may you make their home a haven of peace and joy and a blessing to many. 是的，今天早晨我们为这 Vernon 和 Grace 来献上感恩，为这主你的信实，你的恩典，来感谢你。的确的。你不断的看顾着他们，施恩与他们，你的恩典的确足够他们用，而你够用的恩典也继续的会让他们在前面的路程能够持守他们今天所要立的婚约。愿主你无条件、无限的爱成为他们婚姻的核心和基础。也让他们的一家能够充满着主你的平安与你的喜乐，而让他们所领受的祝福能够从他们身上流露出来，祝福周边的人。愿一切荣耀都归于主。如此祷告，奉基督圣名祈求，阿门。Ladies and gentlemen, ah,、uh, you may take a seat. 大家请坐。As Christians, we not only praise God with songs; we also read His Word from the Bible. On this special day, the couple has chosen to hear from Ephesians chapter three, verses fourteen to nineteen. 身为基督徒，我们不只用我们的歌声赞美神，我们也能从他的话语，就是那记载在圣经里的，去聆听上帝要对我们所说的话。Ephesians chapter three, verses fourteen to nineteen. For this reason, I kneel before the Father, from whom every family in heaven and on earth derives its name. I pray that out of His glorious riches, He may strengthen you with power through His Spirit in your inner being, so that Christ may dwell in your hearts through faith. And I pray that you, being rooted and established in love, may have power, together with all the Lord's holy people, to grasp how wide and long and high. And deep is the love of Christ, and and to know this love that surpasses knowledge, that you may be filled to the measure of all the fullness of God. Today's scripture is from Ephesians three verses fourteen to nineteen. Therefore, I bow before the Father, praying that He may grant you the strength of His glorious riches, 
，借着他的灵，用大能使你们内在的人刚强起来，使基督借着你们的信住在你们心里，使你们既然在爱中扎根建基。就能和众圣徒一同领悟基督的爱是多么的长阔高深，并且知道他的爱是超过人所能理解的，使你们被充满，得着神的一切丰盛。This morning, we are happy to have Reverend Timothy to share on the message. Pastor Elena Yeo will be the translator. 今天早晨，我们很高兴有请裴正牧师从经文分享信息，杨伟晴传道将为我们翻译。A very good morning, ladies and gentlemen, brothers and sisters. 大家大家早上好。Well, my heartiest congratulations to the dashing groom and the lovely bride on this very special day. 我们在这特别的日子，满心的来恭贺英俊的新郎，还有漂亮的新娘。Also, allow me to extend my very best wishes to the families on both sides, the families of Mr. and Mrs. Tay, as well as Mr. and Mrs. Guan. 让我这时也来恭贺双方的家庭，郑夫妇一家，还有阮夫妇一家。Congratulations on raising such wonderful children, from the cute little kids that we saw in the photos earlier to the men and women of virtue that are before us today. 我们也恭贺你们能够培出那么尽谦与良善的孩子们。Our above all, we give thanks to God for His faithfulness and grace upon your relationship. 最重要的，我们为这上帝在你们谈恋爱的旅程中，他的信实和恩典来献上感恩。As I understand, the couple have been dating and courting for seven years since their first semester in university back in 2015. 我所了解的是，在二零一五那一年，新人自从大学的第一个学期就开始相爱了，也相爱了七年。And I think we should thank the university for putting them in the same orientation group. We also thank the university for putting them in the same orientation group. We also thank the university for putting them in the same orientation group. We also thank the university for putting them in the same orientation group. We also thank the university for putting them in the same orientation group. We also thank the university for putting them in the same orientation group. We also thank the university for putting them in the same orientation group. 但靠着上帝的恩典，在彼此彼此相爱的当中，他们还是能够专注于他们的学业，也毕业了。In fact, I think they actually helped each other to study better. So I guess this is something the parents would have approved of. 我想他们也彼此的帮助，呃、嗯，彼此的来读得更好。而我猜想，这能够让双方的家长们都批准他们的关系。Well, from those early days of courtship, we come till today, where God has Joined Vernon and Grace together, we'll be joining them together as husband and wife. 自从初恋的日子，我们就来到了今天。当上帝即将的使结红和蕊诗结为夫妇。And I have personally witnessed part of the couple's journey, especially through their involvement in youth and young adult activities in church. 我深知了目睹新人的一部分的旅程，特别是他们在教会的青年还有清晨事工的参与。And over the years, what has impressed me most about them is not just their love for each other, but their love for God as well. 在这几年来，我所留留让我留下深刻印象的，不单是他们之间的爱，而是而包括了他们对上帝的爱。And indeed, the scripture passage they have chosen for today reflects this. 的确的，今天他们所挑选的经文反映了这一点。Ephesians chapter three verses fourteen to nineteen is a prayer by the apostle Paul that focuses on love. Ephesians three verses fourteen to nineteen is a prayer by the apostle Paul that focuses on love. Ephesians three verses fourteen to nineteen is a prayer by the apostle Paul that focuses on love. Ephesians three verses fourteen to nineteen is a prayer by the apostle Paul that focuses on love. Ephesians three verses fourteen to nineteen is a prayer by the apostle Paul that focuses on love. Ephesians three verses fourteen to nineteen is a prayer by the apostle Paul that focuses on love. Ephesians three verses fourteen to nineteen is a prayer by the apostle Paul that focuses on love. Ephesians three verses fourteen to nineteen is a prayer by the apostle Paul that focuses on love. Ephesians three verses fourteen to nineteen is a prayer by the apostle Paul that focuses on love. Ephesians three verses fourteen to nineteen Three postures for Christian living and marriage. 更仔细的这段经文也邀请我们在基督生活、在婚姻生活中进入了三个状态。And so I hope to commend these three postures to the couple and to all of us here today. 我希望用这这三个姿势来勉励新人，还有今日在座的每一位。
The first posture is the posture of kneeling down. We are to be kneeling before our Heavenly Father. Now, this whole passage is a prayer, and so it certainly speaks of kneeling and praying to the Father. And the posture of kneeling and praying to God is vital for marriage. Because kneeling is an act of humility. It is an act of submission. It's an act of reliance upon God. So many problems in marriage occur when we fail to humble ourselves, when we place ourselves at the center of our world, our universe. And then we expect our spouse and others to revolve around us, our own agenda, our own interests. And this is our natural inclination because we are prideful, we are sinful. So we need to be reminded that the universe does not revolve around me or you or any of us here. So we need to be reminded that the universe and continues to sustain it. And this God alone is the source of life and love. And the passage today commends this Almighty God to us in the glory of the Trinity. When we pray, we rely on God, the Father who has created us and sustains us. When we pray, we rely on God, the Son, Jesus Christ, who has redeemed us from our sin and dwells in our hearts through faith. And when we pray, we rely on God the Spirit who empowers us to live and to love. And so Vernon and Grace, God is for you. God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, they're for, He is for your marriage. And God alone can supply the strength you need to keep loving each other. And the question is, will you continue to seek Him as the source of love? And you may seek him by going down on your knees in prayer. And so Vernon, as the head of the household, may you make it your chief priority to always seek and fear the Lord. And Grace, may you be Vernon's gracious and suitable helper in this. And how appropriate it is that right after both of you are joined as husband and wife later, you will be kneeling at the altar to pray together. So may this kneeling posture define your marriage. May that prayer be, be the first of many prayers, a lifetime of praying and relying upon God. The second posture is the posture of standing firm. 
。第二个姿势是站稳的姿势。Standing firm together as a couple. 就是夫妻一起一起的站站稳。Because the passage tells us to be rooted and established in love. 因为经文接下来告诉我们在爱中生根立基。So this is a picture of our feet being planted firmly on the solid ground of God's unfailing covenant love. 这就是一个把我们双脚站立在上帝不离不弃守约爱的一个情景。It is crucial to do this because there are so many forces that can tear marriage apart. 我们需要这样的做，因为实在是有很多想使婚姻破裂的势力。All our flaws, all our failings are exposed when we are living together 24/7 as husband and wife. 每当我们七天二十四个小时一起住在一起的时候，我们的缺陷和不完美的一面就很明显的这样的泄露了出来。As you might say in Chinese, 婚前喜笑，婚后啼笑啊。<laughs> 有一个话，有一句话就这样说：婚前喜笑，婚后啼笑。That means that there's a joyous laughter before marriage, but then after marriage is like crazy ever after. <laughs> 就是在婚姻之前可以很欢乐的，但是在婚姻之后就变成蛮疯的。<laughs> well, my own experience is marriage has shown me that conflict can arise from even even very minor and mundane things. 我自己的婚姻经验让我看见。冲突能够从非常微小日常生活中的事物产生出来。Such as the way the blanket is placed on the bed, where is the part for the head and the feet? 例如我们在床上如何的摆我们的床被。Or、uh, the toilet seat, do you leave it up or down? 或是我们如何把马桶的椅子翻上或翻下？ I'm sure those who are married, who are here in our midst, you know, can supply more examples. 相信这里已经结婚的都可以列出更多的例子。Of course, conflicts can also arise from more major issues as well. 当然，冲突也能够从更大的事件产生出来。Now, standing firm together, being rooted and established in love, means we hold fast to each other amidst the conflicts. 一起站稳，就是在爱中的意思，就是在冲突中还是。坚固、坚守的彼此的站在旁边，紧紧的握着彼此。So this is the conviction that no matter how bad it gets, you are willing to forgive each other and stand together. 这是一个认知，无论事情有多么的糟，你们还是愿意原谅彼此，还是愿意站在彼此一站在一起的一个信念。And you will hold on to each other for better, for worse, and you will never let go of each other because God. Never lets go of you. 就是在安乐困苦中继续的牵着彼此，而且不会放放放手，因为我们知道上帝他永他从来没有放过我们的手。Standing firm together means living out God's steadfast covenantal love. 一起站稳就是来活出上帝那不改变信实守约的爱。And one practical way of understanding this is to note that you are one. You are always on the same team. So, one way to make us more understand is to note that you are one. You are always on the same team. So, one way to make us more understand is to note that you are one. You are always on the same team. So, one way to make us more understand is to note that you are one. You are always on the same team. So, one way to make us more understand is to note that you are one. You are always on the same team. So, one way to make us more understand is to note that you are one. You are always on the same team. 让我们能够常常的问问自己，如何的从中成为一个更强的一个队伍。Well, my wife and I also quarrel, and then sometimes our kids ask us, "Daddy, Mummy, is it bad that you quarrel?" 当我和我的太太吵架的时候，我的孩子有时候问我，爸爸妈妈，你们吵架是坏事吗 ？My response is, well, it depends on how we end the quarrel. 我对他的反应就是，呃，需要看看我们如何的结束那个争论。If we resolve the conflict in a way that makes our marriage stronger, makes our family stronger, then actually the argument isn't so bad. 如果我们在解决冲突的当儿中，加强了婚姻的关系，加强家庭的关系，那祷告，那那。那吵架说不定是一个坏事。It might even be helpful in allowing us to grow in our marriage. 它甚至可以是一件好事。Now I know Vernon and Grace, you have shared with me that you've learned valuable lessons on communication through your courtship. 那杰红和瑞诗，你和我们，我我分享了在你们的恋爱的当儿中
学习到关于沟通的宝贵功课 And to understand that uh, even when you argue you are aware that you are not against each other 你们说到当你们争论的时候不是针对这彼此 And so that's a great foundation to build on 所以这是一个非常好的一个基础 Remember that you're on the same team 记得你们在同样的队伍里面 So stand firm and stand together in lifelong marriage 所以站立的稳而在终身婚姻中站立在一起 and the third and final posture that the passage commends to us is the posture of reaching out. Because the passage tells us that together with all the Lord's holy people, we may grasp how wide and long and high and deep is the love of Christ. Note that grasping the immeasurable love of Christ comes about in the wider community of the Lord's people. In other words, we experience more and more of God's love as we seek to share it. 换句话说, 我们, 当我们把上帝这份爱分享出来的时候, 我们就更加, and as we love others, reach out to others in love, we are expanding the boundaries. 当我们向他人伸出我们的手的时候, 我们就这样的扩展了上帝爱的这个界限. And may this posture of reaching out, reaching out with God's love come to characterize your marriage. And as I know, as a couple, you are already doing this. I personally witness how you have been such a blessing to so many people in church, and I'm sure many who are here today. 我亲自目睹到你们两个如何的在教会成为了很多每个人的祝福，也成为在座这里每一位人的祝福。and you've told me how you mutually admire each other for being gracious to those around you. So indeed, Grace lives up to her name. <laughs> so And for Vernon, well, I guess God has granted you Grace. <laughs> But really, your coming together in holy union will only increase your capacity to share God's love with others. But really, your coming together in holy union will only increase your capacity to share God's love with others. But really, your coming May your home be a haven of loving hospitality. And so to sum up, Vernon and Grace, may, may your marriage be characterized by these three postures. So Kneeling before God. Standing firm together. And reaching out to others. And in so doing, may you experience and embody the fullness of God's love. And so that one day in the far future, hopefully when both of you have grown old together, 如果你们这样做的话, 可能在未来的一天, Maybe at the time uh, Vernon has less hair or no hair. 当, 当, um, 结红可能是一头白发, Maybe at the time Grace wouldn't be looking so, so radiant, but I'm sure you all will still look good, don't worry. 但, uh, 可能那一天, 瑞士他, 你的头发也不会那么的星光灿烂的, oh, I hope at the time you can look at Look at each other and say this. Well, that through each other we have indeed experienced how wide and long and high and deep is the immeasurable love of Christ. May the Lord bless you. Amen. Amen.
Thank you, Reverend Timothy, for the message, and Pastor Elena for the translation. We'll now invite Reverend Chua Uiswa to proceed with the solemnization. Grace, I ask you now in the presence of God and these people to declare your intention to enter into union with one another through the grace of Jesus Christ who calls you into union with himself as acknowledged in your baptism. Vernon, will you have grace to be your wife to live together in holy marriage? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health and forsaking all others be faithful to her as long as both shall live i will grace we have burned vernon to be our husband to live together in holy marriage we we'll love him comfort him honor and keep him in sickness and in health and forsaking all others be faithful to him as long as as both shall live. I will. So, Sui Jiang Xin Liang Xi Tei Ge, Sui Xin Lang. Sui Wang. Okay. 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 In the name of God, I, Vernon, take you, Grace, to be my wife, to have and to hold, from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, until we are parted by death. This is my solemn vow. In the name of God, I, Grace, take you, Vernon, to be my husband, to have and to hold, from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, until we are parted by death. This is my solemn vow. Let us pray. Bless, O Lord, the giving of these dreams, that they who wear them may live in your peace and continue in the favor all the days of their life. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Grace, I give you this ring as a sign of my vow, and with all that I am and all that I have, I honor you. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Vernon, I give you this ring as a sign of my vow, and with all that I am and all that I have, I honor you. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Vernon and Grace. You have declared your consent and vows before God and this congregation. May God confirm your covenant and fill both with grace. 
Now that Vernon and Grace have given themselves to each other by sovereign vows, every joint of hands and the giving and receiving of rings, I announce to you that they are husband and wife. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and the Holy Spirit, those whom God has joined together, let no one put asunder. Amen. Lamen 平安的所在 O God, we have so consecrated the covenant of Christian marriage that is to represent the covenant between Jesus Christ and His Church Send therefore your blessing upon Vernon and Grace that they may surely keep their marriage covenant and so grow in love and godliness together that their home may be a heaven of blessing and peace through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Now the newlywed will lead us the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and, and forgive, forgive us our trespasses, trespasses as we forgive, forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. The couple will now light the unity candle. This symbolizes two lives becoming one in God. We'll now invite the couple's parents up on stage for the signing of the marriage document. Parents, please.
Thank you, parents. You may head back to your seats. 请双方父母回位就座。Now let us join our hearts to praise God for His faithfulness. Please stand for the closing song. Let us join our hearts to praise God for His faithfulness. Please stand for the closing song. Oh God, my Father, there is no shadow of turning with Thee. Thou changest not Thy compassions; they fail not. As Thou hast been, Thou forever will be. Thy faithfulness, great is Thy faithfulness. Morning by morning, new mercies I see. All I have needed, I can have provided. Great is Thy faithfulness, Lord unto. Reverend Chua, to give us the benediction. Let us invite Chai Mu Shi to give us the benediction. Grace, God the Eternal, keep you in love with each other, so that the peace of Christ may abide in your home. Go to serve God and your neighbor in all that you do. Now may the grace of Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. 但愿主耶稣基督的恩惠、上帝的慈爱、圣灵的感动与能力，常与你们同在，从现在直到永远。阿门。
Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Valentine. <laughs> Welcome back, Mr. and Mrs. Valente. Well, now I invite the couple to share a few words. Everyone, take a seat. 此刻，让我们邀请新人为大家致辞，大家请坐。Uh, hello, everyone. Uh, thank you all for joining us on this special occasion, uh, be it in TA2 or online as well. So we are very touched to have you be with us on this joyous day. You have all been part of my life, no matter how small or large, and I am extremely grateful. For your companionship throughout my life, I would especially love to thank my parents that、uh, you have imparted your cold jokes to me. I will do my duty and impart the cold jokes to our future children as well. In all seriousness, thank you for being the wise, earthly fa figure, fatherly figure that you are. Ever since that I was a child, mum, you have been my wise friend when I needed one. And I am thankful for your gentle nudges to become that man that I am today. May you too continue to park tall even after your grandchildren grow into adults. For my parents-in-law, I would like to take this opportunity to thank you, as well. Thank you for bringing grace into this world and for guiding her to become the lady that she is today. Thank you for allowing me to be your son-in-law and entrusting grace to me. To my brother Eden. Thank you for being part of my life since you were born. I am glad to have known you as a brother, and now as a brother. <laughs> as I carry on in life, do remember that you are always free to connect with me as well. Thank you, and please take care of Rookie. <laughs> <laughs> to my other brother, Ing Chao. Thank you for being our unofficial couple mentor. Even though you did not、uh, officially like, agree to it, thank you for your insights on what a Christian family should be like, and helping us with so much for the wedding. Through all the busy periods in your life as well, really, really honoured to have you as my brother. I would like to thank Uncle Mark and family as well, who is joining us online as well.、Uh, I would like to thank them for the godly guidance and the familial bond over the years, and may you continue to shine God's light to those around you as well. I would like to thank the group that started it all as well. Yenai, thank you for being there through my pharmacy life and spending those times chilling and studying together. To Mera Plus Plus as well, thank you for embracing us into your group. And thank you for helping me chase grace、uh, during the time in RC4, helping me doodle on her door to like ask her out. Yeah. <laughs> to my fellow SAF medics, we have gone through thick and thin together as well. So I am very glad that we continue to keep in touch, and even all, after all this while. And though we are in very varying careers. Right now, do feel free to join any catch up. Or to all my work colleagues over the years, thank you for all your support in my stages, all my stages in my working life, and I will not forget the lessons learned throughout the journey. 
I hope to continue to keep in touch as we continue pursuing our various goals in life. And last but not least, to my new ex-girlfriend and wife, Grace. Though I am full of flaws, you accepted me as I am, and I am grateful that you have chosen me to be your husband. Really, to God be the glory, and the best is yet to come. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, yeah. Mm, yeah, to our closest family and friends, welcome and thank you for being here. We are so blessed to be surrounded by the people who have cheered us on and supported us from the very beginning. And now as we enter this uh, next, next chapter together, we are so grateful to know that you are all part of this moment as well. I want to especially thank my parents for bringing me up to who I am today. Thank you for your care, for providing me with all I need all these years. And Dad, thank you for really thinking of my sisters and I all the time. I can see that every decision you make has us in mind, and I am so grateful for that. Thank you for making sure we are all well provided for, for looking out for us and protecting us, and your life lessons to guide me to be a better person. I will definitely remember them. And to Mom, thank you for all your care and patience throughout these years. I really appreciate all that you have done and love the both of you all very much. And to my new parents and Eden, uh, thank you for showering me with so much love and care and for treating me like one of your very own. Thanks for bringing me out and also um, feeding me. And also in this wedding planning process, thank you for helping us out so much. And I have been truly blessed and I am so glad and excited to be part of your family. And uh, thank you so much for bringing Vernon up to be the fine young man he is today. <laughs> to my dear sisters, it was really nice growing up with you all. Thanks for entertaining me with your silly stories and jokes. <laughs> and for always coming to find me or sit on my bed to talk. Rachel, I always remember those times when we were kids and we played those silly games together. And then when we grew up, thanks for always coming up with random fun things to do like baking or making noodles. <laughs> and uh, you always have plenty of ideas and things you want to do. Thanks for joining us to join you. And to Regina, I really liked our late night HTHT sessions in my room. Thank you for always coming to find me to talk. And your thoughts have always been a good motivation or reminder for me about many things. I will definitely miss living with you all. And so continue to share your jokes and your happy moments and sad moments with me. I will always be here. I would also like to thank the friends that have been with me over the years. My TA2 family, as well as the Mandarin Choir, thank you for walking with me and watching me grow all these years. For godly advice and encouragement and support through each stage of my life, thank you. And um, thank you for warmly welcoming Vernon into our community as well, especially to our, our disciple group, Light, and also many other beloved friends here at TA2. Thanks for all the fun times, oversharings and meals, and for prayer and edifying conversations. And to my SGH friends and colleagues, thank you for being my laughter and support over the past few years, for making work and pre reg so much better. <laughs> and also all the friends I met over the course of pharmacy, Yenai, Mira, and all the others, um, Jax, Diana, all of you, thanks for being a part of my life. Okay, and the second last group of people I would particularly like to thank are those that have supported today's event, the crew on the ground. I'd first like to thank the following people for the smooth event today. Um, the Dencan Productions for our live stream, Dear Pixels for these lovely photos you have seen, the Church AV team, the Ashes, the Worship team, Lily, Ying Yao, uh, Uncle David for the flowers, flowers, and uh, <laughs> Ihan and singing. Our MCs, <laughs> we really couldn't have done this big event with, without all of your help. So thank you for your amazing work and for being so willing to help us. And I'd also like to thank Rev Team, Pastor Elena and Rev Tra for the guidance throughout the years and the blessings Burden and I have received from you all. 
and Mrs. C as well, who is not able to join us today. Um, I thank her for her wise words and her sharings um, so much with us about life and marriage. And I also want to thank our brothers and sisters, especially my four beautiful sisters here. Um, Graces, thank you for your friendship that we have all these years. It's been a blessing to grow um, up with you in church. And thank you for caring for me and sharing your life with me. And Paf, you are the best thing that came out of JC for me. Thank you for being there for me, for your unwavering belief in me and your constant support all these years, and for being more excited than I am about getting married. <laughs> Thank you for both of you and Rachel and Regina for being my bridesmaids and all your help through the planning. And speaking of planning, who can forget our wedding coordinator, where Sherry? Sherry, Sherry who has really helped us a lot with the coordination of everything, especially in the final few weeks nearing today. Thank you for helping us a lot with all the organizing and planning over all these months and for your experiential advice and helping to keep everything on track. Really couldn't have done it without you. <laughs> and finally, a big thank you to Vernon, my husband of today. Yes, as of today. Thank you for, lo <laughs> thank you for loving me. <laughs> for your selfless and gracious heart and for showing me a glimpse of what the unconditional love of God is like. I'm so blessed and honoured to be with you, and there's no other person I would like as a partner to journey through life with. Yeah, that's all. Thank you. Thank you. We've now come to the end of the wedding ceremony. 各位来宾,今天早晨的典礼即将结束. To friends and family online, thank you for tuning in today to celebrate this joyful occasion. I uh, hope that the online stream runs smoothly. 我们再次代表新人,感谢在线上参与婚礼的亲戚朋友们. Yeah, say bye. Good. <laughs> okay, as uh, before everyone leaves, Right, we have a few important announcements.